morning welcome to a new week it's Saturday and it, the Sun is shining at the moment which is glorious I am coloring my hair which is why it looks like this um, so I'm waiting for that to develop and then I'll rinse that off so what's the plans for today so I'm gonna take Poppy to the gym then I'm gonna pick her up take her to PQA um, Holly and Carter I think are cleaning her car uh, I might take Evie to Lexton to the Discovery um, Park for a walk that Holly might come as well um, if it doesn't rain because it is supposed to rain today even though it's glorious at the moment and then tomorrow we've got a barbecue with my mum and dad because we're doing a bit of gardening first I'll show you what we've got to do let me take you there and hope that no frogs jump on my feet while I'm walking. Right, so this is our pergola. And as you can see, we've got a lot of dead bits, dead bits of um, clematis. So we need to get rid of all these, but we have got all our little lights. Um, so we've got to be careful not to chop those they still work oh hello Evie are you gonna come and say hello to everyone say hello everybody hello everybody I've just come from behind the bar which is my favorite spot in the whole world for some reason right so yeah that's the job tomorrow is to get rid of all these dead bits um, but not the live bits which is going to be a bit tricky um, there's our bar if you've not seen it before or for a while it's we need to lower those optics because we can't fit in tall bottles so that's another job for Mark tomorrow if I get a chance to get him to do that he can move them down a bit um, but yeah the gardens actually looking really really nice at the moment it's got lovely flowers oh there's a big buzzy bee in the flower down there buzzy buzzy bee oh you like those yellow flowers don't you buzzy bee get that nectar Go on. I wanted to show you this as well. I can't remember the name of this now. I think mum told me. But look how beautiful that is. I've just tied it all to the stake because otherwise they all fall down. Buzzy bees like that one as well, look. <laughs> so, um, yeah, that's really pretty. I've got some of those as well over here in white. Um, and then there's some poking through the Acer there as well. So yeah, but they're, they're really pretty. Unfortunately, they don't last too long and then you have to cut them all back when they've died. But yeah, garden looks nice with me dragon poking out there. <laughs> and I think we've got a pet woodlouse because this woodlouse has been here for days, just wandering around. I don't know whether he's looking for his family or what he's doing, but Mr. Woodlouse is now a Lord and Lordette pet. We have to give him a name. If you can think of a name for Mr. Woodlouse, other than Mr. Woodlouse, let me know in the comments below. Right, on our way to um, take down the gazebo from last weekend's Father's Day celebrations. And then we are gonna go to the nature reserve to walk Evie before we get Poppy to take her from PQA to work. So it's all go. I haven't stopped. Got home, hung the washing out and did a bit of weeding. And then uh, attempted to clean the washing machine drawer thing, but I can't do it. I need to get one of them Mrs. Hinch Sonic toothbrush things that she uses, because they're really good. Um, so Mark's gonna tackle that later. We've got Evie in the back. There she is. It's hot, isn't it, Eve? <laughs> we just left Polly and Carter washing her car. So, um, that's a disaster. Carter didn't put any shoes on, so he's got sopping wet socks. I did tell him. I did tell him. Right, let's go to the first stop, Lisa's. Look, there's baby geese. Babies. Evie will soon scare them away. We're just going to sit here for a minute. By the way, Mark did Lisa's in case you wondered why we're not at Lisa's. 
He's done the gazebo. Oh, Evie's done a poop. And um, now we've come to the nature reserve and we're just sitting down in the sun for a minute. We said we should have got a drink from somewhere. <laughs> but it's so pretty, let me show you. So this is my view. Can you imagine living in one of those places over there, overlooking the lake? Yes, please. That would be nice. <laughs> Quite fancy that townhouse there. That would be lovely. No good for me legs, but you know, it looks nice. So yeah, we're just going to sit here. Mark's coming with Evie now. After she's done a nice package for him. <laughs> Come on, Eve. Look at that up there. Younger me just wants to go exploring. Older me says, no, you're all right. I'd rather sit on that bench. Here they come. I took a shortcut and Evie's doing sniff a lot dog. Eve! Coming in! This way! No, another sniff. Another sniff. Oh, it's so funny. We just let um, Mark let Evie off the lead because we thought she wanted to go in the long grass and she went the wrong way. <laughs> she, <st> she turned around <laughs> and went backwards. She was just running back. She was like, run home, run home. <laughs> Come on, Eve. Stiff a lot. Oi. That's why. No. Morning. It is Sunday and we've got barbecue today. And it's been raining in the night, so hopefully, I think it's supposed to clear up a bit later, it's just going to be a bit cloudy today. Um, we're going to do some gardening first, but I'm not, because I'm in a flare-up. It started late last night, um, pain started, I had pain in my toes. Now that's a new one on me. I've had pain in my foot, in my heel, in my ankle, everywhere on my foot, but not in my toes. So toe pain is a new one to me. Um, my arms hurt in here and everything, you know when you touch everything on yourself and it just hurts, um, feel sick, feel knackered. <laughs> to be fair, if mum and dad weren't coming around today, I would probably be in bed most of the morning and then probably slump on the sofa for the afternoon in front of films because that's how awful I feel but and Mark was like oh we'll cancel it and I'll just do the food and go I'll send them some food I said no no absolutely no <laughs> so mum it, it's me mum it's my dad you know they're fine. So it's not as if it was like a full-blown party. If it was a full-blown party, yeah, I couldn't cope with it. But it's just my mum and dad. No offence, mum and dad, you know. Um, so they're coming over still in about 15 minutes. So I better get on with my makeup so that I don't look like the Grim Reaper. And um, Mark's at the gym, so hopefully he should be home soon as well. And then we can get on with enjoying the day. I will be sitting on my bottom, probably not doing a lot. I'm just watching them do the gardening. <laughs> I'll probably just be the one making the teas and coffees. Um, but that's fine. That's, fi that's what it is. But I have been in tears this morning because, as I said to Mark and my mum, it's not fair. I look forward to something and fibromyalgia decides to get in the way but it's not getting in the way and it's not winning because i'm still doing it i'm still doing it just adapted um right need to get on my makeup and i'll catch up with you later so this is carter's first gardening experience isn't it <laughs> so they're just chopping off all the dead bits of clematis and then they're going to trail that bit at the top over the top there um i think clark's just enjoying looking at everyone else's gardens aren't you <laughs> like look at you're like one of the meerkats 
You know, like a meerkat that is on lookout <laughs> for danger. <laughs> Look at this. I don't think so. It looks so much better. Mark's turn to be nosy now. <laughs> Imagine if you went in your garden and you just saw you popping up. <laughs> well done. Oh, Carter's down the side there. Falling oh, over yeah. the wood. <laughs> Mark's got his new pinny on. Pinny. Pinny, pinny. What we got cooking then? Chicken. Chicken kebabs. Got some sausages up there. So these ones are the maple barbecue and they're the sweet chilies. Then gluten free sausages. Yeah. And then gluten free burgers and then you've got your lamb yep. kebabs. Mine John's lamb. Yeah, minted lamb kebabs. Lamb. Nice. It started to rain a bit but we're still staying out here. North. We're true Brits. We've got the music playing. <laughs> Dogs were waiting for the food under the table. <laughs> so I've got a food, I've got a mouthful. Hmm. I might take a big bite of burger. <laughs> Here we all are. Dad's got his kebab. Evie's hoping. You're not having it? No. no. Right, easiest dessert ever. Meringue nests, strawberries, um, plant cream, so it's lactose free. And I bought these mini meringues to top it and then I had two left over so I crumbled them on top of each dessert. So that is your easiest dessert ever. And then Poppy's got chocolate ice cream because she doesn't like strawberries and meringues and cream. So that's it, that's dessert done. Maybe it's cause we are Got time and we're wasted Got no plans for the night Back, don't wanna forget ya Yeah, I wanna do it all again So I keep pushing rewind Hoping you'll still by my side We can't get lost in time But don't you wanna do it all again? Start gonna repeat in my mind Dancing with you by my side We can't get lost in time Yeah, I wanna do it all again Good afternoon. Get it right one day. Um, it is Monday. Welcome to the start of a new week. So I had the barbecue and everything yesterday while I was having a massive flare up where to be quite honest I would have probably been in bed most of the day yesterday if it wasn't for the barbecue but I had a nice time. Um, I was in bed at half past eight <laughs> so I was still in bed a bit early. I had a rubbish night's sleep. I find if I go to bed early, then I get really fidgety and restless. But anyway, um, just filmed a favourites in June video that's going to be going up with you next Wednesday. This noise has been going on for the whole of the video, which has been delightful because we've got builders down the road. And um, I just thought I'd show you my little setup. So this is where I tend to film like my sit down talking videos now I find it works really well and then I've just got all my June favourites there 
and I've got a little person, not a little person, but a little dog. A little dogger has been sitting with me on the cushion watching her mummy film the video, haven't you? Yes. And I've well worn this dress because this is part of one of the June favourites, giving the, all, the, all the video away now. <laughs> um, but I am going to change because I'm too hot. And I just want something cosy on and not... What? That makes no sense whatsoever. I'm too hot, so I want something cosy on. That makes no sense whatsoever. What is that sentence? What is it? Anyway, I need to go and titivate my CV now, which I am kind of dreading. So I've been putting it off, but I can't put it off any longer. I'm going to put all this away, sort the CV out, and then get some lunch. Good morning from us. Um, we are going to town today to uh, get some bits and pieces and um, hit the bank and hit Primark and <laughs> hit everything. Hit so, <laughs> not hit people, <laughs> hopefully, not on my scooter anyway. <laughs> <Fair noise. laughs> yeah. More points. <laughs> um, so, let's go. So, we're in precinct, we just had uh, <laughs> we just had a bit of a nightmare with the scooter didn't we? Yeah. It was like, <laughs> you're too tall, sorry, yeah. there you go. <laughs> um, yeah, we were trying to put it together and failed miserably, because you have to take it apart to fit in our boot. So, um, no, so we, in the end I got the man from the ticket office like, to come and help us. He wasn't too impressed by it, but he did it first time, Holly, didn't he? Yeah. First time. So anyway, we're going to go into Primark now. I filmed a Primark come shop with me, so I will link that above for you. I'm not going to film it again. Not at the moment, anyway. I will do one in the future, but not today. Not today. <laughs> right, we're at lunch. Well, we've had lunch. Not that it was very nice, was it? No. Hey, <laughs> wasn't the best I had gluten-free cheese and onion and you had what was bacon chicken and barbecue but it wasn't wasn't the best <laughs> but never mind so we're gonna go and get tea and cake somewhere in a little bit we're just gonna we're gonna um, I don't know if I can get us both in let me just see oh there you go so we're gonna do a few more shops because Holly wants to get a dress don't you for London and then, um, yeah, what else would I get? Oh, birthday cards. Birthday cards. Right, we've got success, haven't we, Holmes? Yes. So we found, what is it, BB's? BB muffins? I think so. Um, do gluten free muffins. So I've got a cherry and coconut, and Holly's gone for apple and cinnamon. And I've got a, a grapefruit lemonade and you've got a cup of tea. Look at the little milk bottle, how cute is that? Mm. You're going to try it, taste test. Is it good? Yeah. Oh, I can't wait to eat this. We're home! <laughs> um, and there's Eve! Oh, mind the thingy. It's Eve! Eve is very <laughs> excited. Ow. Oh, bite Holly. <laughs> wasn't a treaty. <laughs> She's excited oh, with her home. Yeah. <laughs> Don't bite your sister. Don't bite your sister. Right, goodies, goodies, goodies. <laughs> Let's go. Right, what did you get? What did you I get? Dress, but I don't know whether it'll fit, so I've got to try it on. Well, it'll I'll fit, it it's whether it's too after big. After we get back from the walk. And then afterwards I so can it's like on. <laughs> it's a white denim dress, isn't it? Yeah. It's from H and M. But it's I thought you could style it with pretty much anything. Yeah. So it's it's really, really nice. Nice and basis for an outfit. Twelve ninety nine. Fourteen ninety nine. Oh, was it? I thought it was twelve ninety nine. Yeah. Huh. Um, My mistake. This is all from H and M. All from H and M. Little black dress. In the sale, seven pound, wasn't it? 
Six, six pound, even better. My Good battery's age. gonna die in a minute. Oh. <laughs> I can't get a new one, hang on. Right, battery's changed. Oh, that is such a cute skirt. And that was in the sale, wasn't it? Seven pound from H&M? Seven pounds. Seven pounds. Very nice, very nice. Um. Oh, this is so cute, this top. When I saw it, I was like, that is a holly top. Seven pounds. Very cute, very cute. Oh, I got a dress in the sale. Seven pounds. Everything's seven pounds. Look at that beauty. And it's got little, oh, just dropped it. It's sort of a chiffon-y yeah. style material. I thought it'd be nice for the winter. Not probably now, but winter will soon be upon us. Oh yeah, I bought Poppy some uh, French fry socks. She loves character socks. And um, I thought she's going to absolutely love them because she likes black socks as well at the moment. So best of both worlds. So that's the first bag done. Yeah. Coolio. Oh, I'll show you the earrings I got while you're going through the second bag. Oopsies. So there was a little stall. Try and do this one-handed. Ow. No, I'm good, thanks. Um, there was a little stool in the middle of the precinct and I, oh, let me just focus in, there you go. I think, yeah, I have got it the right way up. So I found these. Now I've been looking for some navy blue earrings for I don't know how long and they were £5.50 and I really like the square design so I treated myself to them. Very nice. Okay. I got, also got some big mix. Yeah, she got a pick a mix. My sweets, Carter. I got this blazer. Yeah. To style over things would go nice with that dress. Very nice. Um. Yeah, that would be a good outfit for when you're in London. With my black boots. Yeah, you could have the black boots, the black or dress, and the blazer. Would, also, my blue heels would be nice. Or my black heels. Or your beige boots, but then you're taller than Carter. Oh yeah. I thought this was the denim dress, this is yours. Oh, that's my dress. I've got two dresses. two dresses. They were both in the sale. I did splash out. So this one was from New mm. Look. And I thought it was really pretty nice. that I can yeah. wear it again with just sandals when it's nice and warm or with leggings when it's not. Um, I got some more shorts. Oh, they're really cute. They might fit me left thigh. But they're very nice. Very nice. Um, oh, this is a holly top if ever I saw one. This is all new look, by the way, now. At the moment, yeah. So pretty. It looks a bit like Minnie Mouse. Yeah. Minnie Mouse I top. If I ever went again. Yeah. Oh. We'll go one day. Uh, and this one. I spotted this one. Is that ice cream? It does look like ice cream. Ice cream. Raspberry ice Ripple. Cream. Yeah. Is that it? From New Look. Yeah. Right, that's it from New Look. I got this dish to put my baked oats in. Oh yeah, that is from Wilco's. Yep. That was £1.50. Uh, can I show you? You're going to have to make me some baked oats, you know. Alright. I've never had I'll baked oats. Some. Tastes like cake. Oh, you can show that. Oh yeah, I forgot. This is for Nanny. Yeah, so this shirt is for my mum because she wanted a shirt she could wear over the top of tops and things. No, it was £11. Oh, Eve. Eve just fell out of the bags. Um, £11 from Primark. So, yeah. I like that. Yeah. Keep it for myself. <laughs> oh, it's all tangled up. Yep, yeah, that's really pretty. Definitely a U-top. Could wear with the shorts. Or the skirt. Or the skirt. And a little top. Yeah, it's got like a little... Oh, yeah. Oh, how much was that top? That was six pound. That other one, wasn't it? That's that one. Six pounds. This one is. That one's four. Four. And it's got a little motif. There, look, a little flower. Very pretty. Very pretty. Um, I got some underwear, but. Oh yeah, we won't show the underwear. Show you my underwear. No. Is that it? Yeah. And we got Dad a muffin. Oh yeah, because it was buy two get one free. So his. Mom so he's got the free one, and I hope I haven't squashed it, because I. I chucked something on there, my bag. But yeah, that's it.
Back. Your Wally. Look at her. She's walking around like a ghost. <laughs> My dad just popped round and uh, he put the blanket on her on the sofa and now she's jumped off and it's still on. <laughs> Come here. Look. There you go. There you go. There you go. Do you want to come up here on it? Look. A hop. A hops on it. Hop. Come on. Hops. Hop. A hops. hops. You have to lift her up. You lazy dog. Come on. Ready. 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 Plonk. There you go. Right. So you've got blanket there, and yet you're sleeping over there. You're going to make my blanket smell. Oh, wee. Yes, you are. Oh. Our kisses. Because <laughs> you just had a Pringle. <laughs> cupboard love, cupboard love. Yeah. You will cuddle me. <laughs> Evie's like, help! <laughs> good morning. No, good afternoon. Told you, I never get it right. Um, just about to get on with some editing. Like I say, Dad just popped over because Mum wanted something laminating. Holiday list or something. Well, I didn't know you had a laminator. Yeah. I bought the laminator when um what in the upper class <laughs> it's I had it for when I looked after Ben at school mm. and I needed to laminate all his stuff and um then I've just kept it obviously and used it for personal things so it's only like a little portable laminator, it's not a full blown massive crossy one. Road. Crossy road, yeah. Why? Got it again because I was like, I was just sitting there and I was like, I remember this game. Crossy Road. And I had sudden urge to play it at like one o'clock in the morning. And the tablets are working well, making him <laughs> sleep then. <Yeah. laughs> Hello. I don't usually film in the evenings. It's like nine o'clock nearly, and um, look at the state of me. <laughs> I'm in my pajamas. Um, I'm just making the, well Mark's made for me, the lemon and ginger tonic. I feel awful again tonight, but I said to Mark I think it's because I'm stressing myself out um, about the call I'm going to get tomorrow from Scope to, because we've got to write my covering letter tomorrow, because there's a job that I want to go for um, that's nearby, um, that's in a little sort of gifty shop. And that's sort of my dream job, so it's part time obviously. So we're, he's going to help me write the covering letter tomorrow and I think I'm stressing myself out about it. And that's what's bringing on a flare up, so I've got to try and chill out a bit. It's no good making myself worse, <laughs> but it's easier said than done isn't it? So um, yeah, just going to sort this lemon and ginger tonic out and then I'm going to watch I think it's called Olivia Meets Her Match or something on ITVB. I really like that. It's really bad. It's like cheesy. So I like it. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you tomorrow. Good afternoon. It definitely is good afternoon because it's half past two. My Tesco shopping should be here any minute. So I'll have to sort that out when it comes. Um, I haven't really done a lot today because my fatigue is so bad at the moment. I did do jazz this morning, I did jazz stretch, um, but even that took it out of me and the grass needs cutting and I can't do that. It's just, I'm just fed up with feeling so fatigued, like it's an effort to do anything and with a house with five of us plus probably had a friend to stay over again last night, it's an awful lot of 
work like to keep the place looking nice and everything so and it's even harder when you're so fatigued um but anyway i've just had some lunch and i'm waiting like i said i'm waiting for the tesco shopping evie's not very good I'll show you eve you're not very happy dog today are you no she's uh been biting at her back legs you could probably see how sore they look from here um and i've been putting some cream on but i've run out of a lot of her cream so i'm trying to egg it out before we can get to get the next tube um but yeah she's not not a happy dog today she's even had trouble walking on it because it's so sore so i i do feel sorry for her but i said to her if she keeps biting it i'm gonna have to put the cone of shame on her um and we all know that evie hates the cone of shame but <laughs> yeah i'm just fed up with feeling fatigued i wonder if it's a combination of two things weather being one and secondly i've got my scope call this afternoon at four o'clock and i'm wondering if I'm getting myself stressed out about it and all about the work situation because we all know how stress affects fibromyalgia and ME. I think a lot of that has got to do with how I'm feeling because part of me really wants to go for the job but part of me already is thinking can I do it is my body going to be capable um, what if I get the job, do the job, but sorry, I thought she was licking, but then can't do it anymore and have to leave, and I've lost my pip, and then I've got to reclaim pip again. You know what if that happens? It's going to be a nightmare. I mean, I've fought so hard to get my pip, and it worked so hard to try and get that, and not that I want to claim pip because I don't. It's the worst thing to have to claim pip. I would give anything to be able to work rather than claim it but I just worry that I'm going to do do a job which my body won't cope with and then I have to leave and then reclaim Pip again you know but as I say in my stress videos you shouldn't worry about things that are out of your control and at the moment this is completely out of my control well apart from the fact that I could just say stuff it I'm not going to go back to work I'm just going to stay at home and that would be in my control but it's not what I want mentally mentally I need something else so it's a difficult time <laughs> let's put it that way it's a difficult time and I think all of that is just affecting my illness drastically at the moment um, and I think I might try and explain some of that to the scope man this afternoon and because usually when people ask me if I'm all right and I say yeah I'm okay or how are you doing yeah I'm fine and they're like oh that's good and you think well I'm not but I just can't bother to tell you but I think today I might say I'm not brilliant and explain why oh Miss Angela's coming over tonight as well because we're, they're coming to centre parks with us so we're going to come up with a food and drink shopping list so like planning what we want to get on the way so that should be good it'd be nice to see her um, and I'll try and get her on the vlog for you there she is <laughs> said I'd get you on the vlog <laughs> it's just bonkers <laughs> Mark's still having his dinner <laughs> it's friday 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 oh it's friday happy friday and today i have very sad news my pet woodlouse has run away yes mr woodlouse has gone he's not there anymore so i reckon he's found his family and they've scuttled off under the shed <laughs> so Goodbye, Mr. Woodlouse. He is no more a part of the Lords. Um, anyway, <laughs> today, today, uh, Evie has a haircut, which does worry me a bit because of how sore her skin is at the moment. 
but I also think it will do her good to have a haircut because she's obviously feeling hot in this weather at the moment. So I'm going to just tell the groomer to, <coughs> sorry, be very gentle with her and, you know, be a bit careful. Um, so yeah, I'm dropping, it's stupid o'clock, it's half past eight in the morning. It's half past eight in the morning, I'm kind of looking all right. <laughs> Hair could do with some straightening, but I can't be asked. Um, and yeah, she's due there at nine, so I had to wake up at half past six because I don't know if you remember, but I have to have an hour in bed before I get up, otherwise, I fall over. Um, I just go plonk. <laughs> so yeah, I've had my lemon and ginger tonic, I've had an hour in bed, got up, had a shower, done my makeup, done my hair, got dressed. Let me show you dress of the day. Let me show you, where can I put you? Where can Here is my dress. Here is my dress today. It's a Primani one. Um, it was, I think it's still there. I believe it's still there when I went with Holly the other day. If you fancy getting your hands on it, I think it was between 13 and 15 pounds, something like that. But yeah, it's nice and light because it's quite sunny again today. It's supposed to be up to 24 today, so that's nice. Oh, I've just noticed a pom-pom on the floor, look. Oh. Pom-poms come off me cushion. I have to stitch that back on. Will I do that? Probably not. Leave it there. Mr. Pom-pom can stay there. Um, so yeah, that's my plan. And then going for breakfast, did I say that? Going for breakfast with mum and dad? Because mum and dad go on holiday tomorrow for a week. So... Um, yeah, I'm going to see them this morning for breakfast while Evie's having her hair cut. And then I've got to edit this and get this ready to be uploaded tomorrow. And then hopefully I'll be able to get to sit in the sun at some point, which would be lovely. Um, so yeah, let's get going. Uh, oh my goodness, that my breakfast has arrived. Okay. Mum and Dad have gone like with toast because they've already had breakfast. <laughs> We're busy two shoes. <laughs> But I've gone for um, a nice breakfast, so I'm going to eat this and enjoy it. Good. All right, I'm home. Home from breakfast. It was very nice. And Evie's had her cut. Where is she? Under the table. But we're just going to play Harry Potter Trivial Pursuit, which is here, with the girlies. One there, one over on the bench. That, that cover is for my scooter. I'm going to move it because it looks really tacky. Um, so who's going to win this? Not sure. Oh, it's going to be a hard one. They're both Harry Potter fanatics. Or it could be me. Mm. No, doubt it. <laughs> Purple. Yeah. Holly. What does Ron drink in Professor Slughorn's office that has been poisoned? A few moments later. I'll give you a clue. What did I not like when we went to the castle weekend? Oh. Can you remember what it was called? Can I say it? Yeah, but can I still say it? Um. Remember when I said I do not like... Yeah, all right, right, there's too many clues now. Oh, oak matured mead, but yeah. Why is that so specific? I know. So Pops, your turn. Pink. Pink. Why does Hermione use the spell Protego Totalum around the trio's campsite after they escape the Ministry of Magic? To stop um, snatchers from seeing them. Or just to protect them. Yeah, I'll give you that because it's a protective enchantment. So you can have that one. Thanks. That's all right. Pops, who won? Me. <laughs> I came second, Holly came last, but she had really hard questions. Uh, well... I think she did. She did, but... But... <laughs> right, I'm going to leave the vlog here this week because I've got to no, edit it. Sorry. Yeah, well, she's under the table. I'll show them next week. I'll crouch down. That's, hang on, Poppy's going to crouch down to show you in. Don't disturb her, though. And there she is. A wild Look at that dog. Look at she her. Had a hard day. Doing what? Pooing on the stones. Yeah. Right. 
so I'm going to leave the vlog here this week hope you've enjoyed it um, oh just had a bug on me arm don't forget to give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe if you've not done already don't forget to ring the bell so you receive notifications of when I upload and I will see you all on Wednesday for the weekly oh and don't forget to also follow me on my social media because um, I do lots of polls and things on there to see what videos you'd rather have um, so definitely check that out and yeah see you all on Wednesday for the Wednesday upload don't forget to leave me a nice comment. Love you all lots. Bye. Mwah.